I told you last night the motherfucking tables turned. Bruh, I had to call customer service. Yeah, I had to call them motherfuckers three times, back to back. Yeah, I was that annoying motherfucker calling back to back about the same shit. Every time I called, bro, I got a shitty employee. Getting shitty ass served. And that had me contemplating calling motherfucking corporate. This is freaking ridiculous. You, you know what, look, let me talk to your supervisor, alright? Now, I ain't do all that, but, but it really made me think. This is shit I be doing. Can't even get mad, but it really puts shit in perspective. Now, you would think that I would go through that experience. And take it in stride and try to be a better employee. You know, try to do my job better. Stride to bring my callers customer satisfaction. But it didn't. It, it didn't do none of that shit. Honestly, whoever called my job today, you gonna feel my motherfucking wrath. You gonna get this motherfucking work. You call my job today talking about good morning. I'm telling you, fuck you. Fuck you in your morning. Listen, I was a bad customer service representative before. Shit, yesterday I fell asleep on the call. Why the motherfucker was talking? But now, now I want to be the best, worst customer service representative in the history of customer service. Oh, you gonna get on the phone with me and you gonna beg me to transfer you to one of the motherfuckers in India. I don't care. L listen, I'm just here so I don't get fined. Last night, I feel like the motherfuckers at Wells Fargo challenged me. They think that they can have worse customer service than me. No, no, I run this shit. I'm the worst customer service representative of all time. But y'all can't fuck with me. By the way, listen, if my supervisor see this motherfucking video, I I'm, ju I'm just kidding. Entertainment purposes only. I, I, I love it, him. I, I love it. Love it.